Hello, Richard here. Today I'm going to teach you how to properly apply the two-handed ratcheting tourniquet in the tactile field care phase. The first step is you need to expose and assess the wound. Reassess any tourniquet applied in the care under fire, and if bleeding is not controlled, tighten the tourniquet. If the bleeding is still not controlled, apply a second tourniquet side by side with the first. Remove the tourniquet from the casualty's JFAC or carrying pouch. Slip the wounded extremity through the loop of the tourniquet strap or route the strap around the limb. Position the tourniquet about two to three inches above the wound and directly on the skin. Pull the strap as tightly as possible, removing all excess slack. Ensure all slack in the strap is pulled through the routing buckle before tightening the ratchet device. Ratchet the maneuver device as tightly as possible until the bleeding has stopped, completing the process within one minute. Next, lock the ratchet on itself. It will click into place. If bleeding is not controlled or a distal pulse is present, continue to tighten the ratchet tourniquet or apply the second tourniquet above the original tourniquet. Annotate the time of tourniquet application on the safety strap or the casualty's forehead, completing the process within three minutes. Document all treatment on the DD Form 1380 TC3 casualty card and attach it to the casualty.